All right, I am kind of in the market for playing the fun police if we, we get good cards for the fun police, which we currently didn't. Lava Mancer is acceptable if we're drafting Mono Red. But also, hello everybody and welcome. We are drafting a more Legacy Cube. We could take the Jitte. People like taking Jitte pack one pick one in cubes like way too aggressively in my opinion. But to be fair, this pack is not great. Yeah, I think it's fine timing, Caroline, because we're starting the new draft. Uh, our last card is a Forsake the Worldly. Bursting and Bad if I want a Mono Red. I do want a Mono Red. We haven't drafted Mono Red at all. All right. How about this? Let's just take Mono Red. I think this is better than Jinte. I think we take Burst Lightning and let's see if we can get there on, like, on drafting the Mono Reds. Then we can complete this draft fast. That's true. That's the other benefit, because I don't think I was going to play this entire draft, but if we play Monored, we might just be able to finish it. Like, Hazard's pretty good for Monored here. Burst Lightning over Jitte, what a world. I'm going to grab Bibisita and in the side go shopping for stuff to go. Oh, are you cooking dinner, Luis? That sounds really, really, really yummy. I am in for that. I wasn't planning on finishing this draft for what it's... Uh, any requests? Whatever you're feeling. Um... Pork belly is always very good. I do love it when you have a Coke pour, but pork belly. Can you pick up a bottle of wine? I kind of feel like having some wine tonight. I don't know. We don't have any. All right. We're taking Hazaret. There are no good mono red cards in this bag, unfortunately for us. Oh my gosh. You're right, Luis. All right. Never mind. Don't worry. Don't worry. We could take Legionnaire. Legionnaire is a mono red card. I really want to try to get there on Mono Red. I think our deck is going to be really bad by forcing this, but I think if we get there, it's going to be great. Like, we haven't seen any of the small red creatures. Uh, I think we just take Perforo, so I, I'm not super excited about having all these, like, fours in my deck. Hangerback is not really where you want to be at with Mono Red, in, in my opinion, so maybe we just take Perf and... Count our blessings. Uh, oh my god. All right, hold on, hold on. Bow my courier. I feel like we're hanging by a thread to make this deck happen. Uh, Koth, though? I think it's the bow, the bow my courier is more important than the Koth, for what it's worth. I think we maybe hope to wheel a Koth or something. I do think taking the, like, one drops is super duper duper mega important, because you have a lot of cards that you can play on that are more expensive. That's a costly, costly pick. Stagger Shock is good. Stagger Shock is a good one. We need more little creatures. All right, come on, little creatures. Yes, perfect. Falcon and Gorger, we're getting there. Little creatures. This deck is looking not too bad right now. I think we might be, we might be getting there. If somebody's taking our other things, they might be convinced to abandon ship now. Yes, perfect Falcon Earth Cordure. Don't quote me on that. Don't quote me on that. You're making me embarrassed. Remember when Jackal Pup was too powerful for reprint? Really? Is that is that true? Too late I've been quoted. Oh well shrug. Ah, uh, wow, we didn't get there. We didn't get there on nothing. I think we just take Blackleaf Cliffs and feel super bad. We could take Phyrexian Rager, maybe. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, yes, we wield the Lava Mancer. Perfect. No one's in Mono Red. Oh, feels good, man. Cliff for Scrap Heap. Uh, yeah, we could have maybe played Cliff for Scrap Heap. Maybe. Okay, we didn't get anything here. If we're going to be truly Mono Red, Westvale Abbey actually kind of works. So we can take the Abbey, put it here, though. To be fair, there weren't that many things that we could wheel when we saw these packs, because these are the packs we've already all seen. These are all pretty bad. City of Brass. 
Cedar Rest could work for, like, black activation of, of Scrappy and stuff. But I do think that one's a Monored, because that uh, Grim Lava Mancer wouldn't have wheeled. That Lava Mancer would have gotten picked up at some point. Instead, I found out that the first Doctor on my dad's side next... Oh! That's really cool, Flower Power. I love it. Oh, yeah, Splashing Red for Gettin' Effects is, is possible. I don't love playing... when Like, when I play red in this cube, I just want to play red. I don't want to play, like, mix it with white. Like, I think... Yeah, we're not playing any of these. It's Jackal Familiar, not Jackal Hound. Ooh, okay. Oh my gosh, don't tell me that in the whole opening. The, the last card might be our saving grace. Torch Fiend? I guess we're taking Torch Fiend. This pack was horrible for Motorhead. Metamorph? Yo, Saloon, how are you? Thank you. Welcome back to the four months. Maze is not good in Monored, I don't think. I mean, yeah, I guess that we copy something big. Is that better than Torch Fiend, though? Maybe maybe we have to bank on Torch, Fear, Torch, Fiel, Torch Fiend wheel, wheeling. <laughs> there you go. Hmm. I think we might have to be Boros Bad Mana and take a Sacred Foundry here. No, it's not Kiki. I don't think. We're not even getting like really cut by anyone because the first pack was just like our own pack and there was nothing there. And then this is just like one person taking one card. So it wasn't doesn't necessarily mean there wasn't a mono red card here. Or like it doesn't mean that a red card was taken. Bolas, you are more ambitious than I am. Uh, Dress Cole. All right, I'm going to take Sacred Foundry, I think. Uh, okay, man, we got there. Cool, Goblin Guide is here. Um, oh, Kiki knows I love him. He also knows that this is not the deck for him. Yeah, there was just no red in those packs. Hopefully we wield the fork bolt. That would be so nice. Uh, nice. Okay, cool. We're getting the stuff that we need. Cool. I think it was just that those two packs were, like, pretty bad. And we couldn't get anything the first time around. Because now we can just take Searing Spear and maybe wield the Chandra's Phoenix. Yeah, I think that's good. All right, yeah. Cool, we got past the bolt. Hordling Outburst is not bad, but maybe we try to wheel the Outburst. So we take Bolt, wheel the Outburst out of that. We take Rift Bolt here. I think it's better than the Siege Gang. Because you want your cards to be super duper cheap in this deck. You don't want to go too big. We are kind of doing it now. So yeah, definitely, definitely... There's no one drafting red, I don't think, because of the cards that we're getting. But we were just, those two packs were just really bad. Ooh, Collective Defiance is very good for this. All right, we're actually doing it now. We are actually getting there. It's also, um, the Hordling Outburst is really nice with Perforos. This is a three. This is also a three. This is a one. This is a three. Wait, this is three, 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 three. This is four. These are all ones. One, 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 one. Yep. There you go. So now it's actually ordered. Oh, yeah, sorry. Legionary is the one that's the two. I knew one of these was in the wrong spot. <laughs> the Torch Fiend came back. I think we just take the Torch Fiend. Yeah, we, we got there. Our Torch Fiend wheeled <laughs> everything we ever wanted. Okay, cool. So now we just need like seven more playables, basically. And we have one more pack. We can get there. 
It's not like this is the best mono red deck I've ever seen, but it's actually got a lot of the pieces we want. Is Sulfur and Vortex in this cube? Because that would be amazing. It's not? Oh well. Uh, we're not playing any of these. I guess Pyroclasm to the sideboard? We're not playing any of them though. It seems like we're embracing the smork lifestyle. Yeah, so Cup, I wanted to do one more draft, but I knew I wasn't going to be able to finish it. And I do like drafting Monored once, at least once. Ooh, I like Kologon's Command, but we're not playing it. Yes, we wield the Phoenix! Perfect. Okay, this deck looks not bad. We need six playables from the last pack. We can totally get there. And we are for sure going to be playing Westvale Abbey. And not, probably not City of Brass and probably not Sacred Foundry. And nothing else in the sideboard is even remotely playable. Okay, good to know. Uh, Sulfuric Vortex is not in the cube is what some people were saying in chat. So I think we are drawing dead for that Sulfuric Vortex. Yo, happy Friday to use the tail. Or actually, that's State of Matt, isn't it? Huh, it is State of Matt. Uh, I guess just Seeker of the Way, Relic. Yeah, we might board that in, who knows. Firebolt's not bad. And Manic Vandal's not good. So I think we just take Fireball and count our blessings because we're not going to wheel anything out of this pack. Heroic Reinforcements is not bad, but I just don't think it's what we want in this deck. It's obviously, like, pretty good, but it forces into being white, which we're not. Also, I, I feel like I've seen that card wheel every single time, and I'd rather have a Firebolt in my deck. So I think... I think... And no one's going to splash it if no one... I don't think people are going to just randomly splash that card. So I'm going to take the Firebolt and hope that that wheels. And if it wheels, I might play it. Ooh, I like Ferocidon a lot. This card is impressive. Has been impressive for these kinds of decks. It's not like this card is like great. <laughs> yeah, it, you know it's too strong for standard, so clearly you know it should be in our deck. So let's take that. Stroke is good, but um, I think I'd rather have the Ferocidon. There's a chance we wanted to take the uh, or stroke, stoke, stoke the flames and try to wheel the Ferocidon. We are playing the fun police. Wee-oo, wee-oo. Jackalpup, yeah. Wheel the char out of this pack. The pup was going to come back because all the ones are coming back. So maybe we just take the char? Yeah, so I think maybe we just take the char. I don't think fight with fire is what we want. Um, I think we just take a char, because this can't actually go phase. Just take char and wield a pup out of that pack. Um, these are all pretty bad. Chain lightning's not the worst, it's just a one mana. Just a cheap spell, throw one for three. Alright, not too shabby. Okay, then we need two more playables and maybe replace Perforos or Torch Fiend. We need more creatures. This Chandra is so bad. Uh, I guess we could take Harvester. Nah, I don't want to splash. I hate splashing in mono red decks. I think it's the worst. So you cannot convince me to play Ravages here. But we could take Field of Ruin. Oh yeah, we can also... Metamorph is also kind of medium for us. That Chandra is pretty bad, Coyote. It's like the worst of all the Chandras in the cube. I think I'm just gonna take Field of Ruin. We'll get two more playables from the other packs. Yeah, this is actually fine. We can take Fire. I like the Scry off of this because it helps us smooth out our draws. You got to ult the Chandra today? Wait, that Chandra? 
That's pretty cool. She copies stuff, right? I think. Wow, that Emrakul's going around late. Ooh, I like Mishra's factory in this deck. Ooh, I like it a lot, actually. Because we're just going to be red. And I don't think we care about the Iron Shaman too much. And it's not really Bonfire of the Dam. That's, like, for a different kind of deck. I think you want that in the deck with Library Manipulation and ra other Wraths. So let's take Mishra's Factory. Oh, we got there. Strong Creek Noble. Perfect. It did come back. So we'll take it even though I don't think we're playing it. All right, we're getting there. We totally are getting there. Yeah, Stoke the Flames came back. Perfect. So that's 24. So now we can start making replacements. The Jackal Pup is going to come back. Yes. Perfect. Yeah, this deck ended up, like, pretty nicely. Especially considering we, like, very much forced it. Oh. Scalding Tarn? Four picks left? What? Yeah, I can just get the Metamorph now. Uh, and I would play 16 lands in this deck. Oh, she is old. You play the field, the Mistress Factory, and now I don't have to play the Westville Abbey because I have the field and the Mistress Factory. You just play Mistress? I mean, I am going to play 16, so I, 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 I will have less lands in general, so I do want to hit my colored sources. Are, is Perforos good? No. No, it's not good, but we don't have something to replace it with. I could play the Tarn for the Lava Man. Yeah, I can see that. So we play Tarn, Mishra's Factor, and not Field. All right. So basically, we're at 24. So any card that we get now that's good replaces anything. I'll take the Ravages, but we're not playing that. Okay, this deck builds itself. To oh, interesting. Iron Shaman, huh? You'd Ravages? I mean, the Scalding Tarn does change the Ravages. I just think it's so, so unbelievably bad to be splashing in these decks. But my lands do come into play on top. If I go City of Brass, Sacred Foundry, and Sacred Foundry is fetchable by Tarn, it actually does make it kind of playable. Or when did you say that, BK? I missed it. Are you not... Yeah, no, I don't need planes with this, because I can just... I have three free sources. I still want to play the Mistress Factory, I think. And I could play the Ravages. I, see, the only reason I think the Boros decks are really bad is because people start playing Needle Spires and shit, and those are really bad. That makes me kind of want to play Heroic Reinforcements, too. I hadn't seen this deck when I said that. Wait, are you not proud of me, VK? Come on, this is a good mono red deck. Why are we, why are we hating? No, I like Legionnaire quite a bit. I think Legionnaire is good. I think we can get rid of Perforos. I think we can cut like Torchy and maybe like Perforos. This is a good deck. Come on, BK. Yeah, and we cut Perforos because he sucks. And then we play Heroic Reinforcements Ravages. I could cut the Mistress Factory, just play like one more planes, and then I have four sources for those. Yeah, oh no, don't worry. Porcelain Engineer is going to be here. Don't worry. Alright, there you go. So now we have four sources for these two. That sounds fine. And the Mistress Factory. Oh wait, we are, we have more... I want to play 16, not... Yeah, I'm short one cut. Oh, I'm short one cut. No, I like all of our ones. I don't want to cut ones. We could also try to play 15. This deck is just curves out at four. Yeah, we could get the Iron Shaman. Yeah, that sounds good. Iron Shaman's pretty shitty. All right, cool. We got ourselves a plan.
Cut a three? Mm, technically, that shaman's a three, so I think cutting that is reasonable. And Torchy's pretty awful. I like all of our threes as a thing, too. I can never beat this deck with any of my cube decks. I'm so scared of it. I always lose to these decks, too, BK. I always dress slow, dirtily decks. Could, can, they, they can't beat... Raptor was making fun of me the other day, but it was like, look, you don't understand. I've never been... Uh, what's his face? Um, <laughs> I've never beaten Student of Warfare in my life. Uh, yeah, this looks fine. And we also have the Sacred Foundry for, for the Splash, so we can just kick it off with, like, Jackal Pop on turn one. I got a message. Oh, hey, I know who you are. Oh, hi there. Good luck, have fun. Yeah, who dat? Thank you so much, Tilda Tony, for the three months. I appreciate that. Three months. Three months. How are you doing, Gabby? It sounds so weird. Ooh. Tilda Tony, you gotta let us know how you do. I'm very excited. You gotta remember to come back on Monday. You gotta tell us how it happened. Yeah, you get a snake hat today. You're a Pokemon trainer. Yeah, I know the echo's pretty bad. I. It's somewhere in my alerts, and I couldn't figure out where to fix it. I tried to fix it, and it didn't work out well. So... Oh, yeah, we're playing the fun police. Wee-oo, wee-oo. The O3 police is here. Coming for your money. All right, let's just get in there with Jackal Pup. Okay. Uh, Lava Man. Chain Lightning you. Okay. This is actually going fine. I can't exile the Firebolt, though. So I think um, I am just going to attack with these two because I'm probably planning on just charring their face in a second. And then the Lava Mancer can use those two to hit once more. What are the Ice Cream Cone badges? Uh, when you donate bits to the stream, you get badges, and uh, one of the badges that you get... Ooh... Okay, I'm still just gonna go face because I'm gonna firebolt that down. Yo, we're Munger! Thank you! Alright, I'm gonna char their face. Oh, nice. Hold on. We can just hazard it now. Yeah, we're Munger! I'm happy you're enjoying it. Thanks for joining us. Hey, can anyone confirm the Ravnica pre-release midnight the night? It's always on like Friday night. Friday night is when you can actually do it. Um. Yeah, we're sending with everybody, even the Lava Man. Lava Man. Oh shit. That is big game. That is a big game. How do we kill them? Without them... No, because this is two and two. Oh, we, we can discard to has too. Yeah, so we fireball, discard to has, and then Lava Mancer. All right, yeah, that works, cool. It did feel like we had the kill somewhere here. No, it's not still four, because you exile these two Hidden for two, firebolt them, and then you discard with, with Hazzy. You have enough to do everything. Oh, no, 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 you don't. Shoot, you don't have the mana for everything. Fuck. You're a mana short, because you can... <laughs> Smash with Haz and Bolt, Grizzle, Grizzle Boy dead.
I could kill Grizzlebrand. They will gain seven. Because if I play the land and attack with Hazret, they're going to block for sure. It takes five, then we firebolt the Grizzlebrand dead. And then we try again over the next couple turns. It kind of sucks, because they're going to draw seven for sure. But I think it's the only out. And I don't want them to know... Well, they can see the on-the-board trick, because I have this here. So I do think we still play... So we do play the Tarn. Okay. So I'm going to attack with Pup and Hazret. If they block here and take five here, I can bolt this down and then firebolt them to kill. Um, if they block here, they'll gain seven, then they'll have a man to kill, and they'll take another two here. So, all right, here you go. Oh, I guess we could have sent them with Mishra's Factory, too. Yeah, Seth, I just realized. So we do have okay attacks. I, I don't like that they're going to get to draw 7 off of Grizzlebrand. That part sucks. Oh, wow. That was aggressive. Let them connect. There you go. Why did they think that was going to work out? That was... Maybe they thought we wouldn't see that we could, like, kill our own blocker or something. They had a good block on Hazaret. Uh, Relic of Progenitus looks kind of interesting here. Yo, you're back from Froyo? I, I am jealous, Molly. Look at what we drafted. We're the fun police now. Look at me. I am the fun police now. I wish this could be targeted enchantment. We just got started. We just finished our draft. <sighs> Relic of Progenitus does sound good against Reanimator. I think we, we are supposed to play it. I think maybe I don't want Ravages against this opponent, but I do want the Heroic Reinforcements. All right. Our opponent's uh, streaming too, apparently. <laughs> if anyone comes to Mini, I promise I'll take him to Freyo. I almost ended up, yeah, maybe Metamorph copy their big creature. That's that's a reasonable take. I'm gonna keep. Our hand is very nice. <laughs> Heroic reinforcement. We can also get Sacred Foundry with this, which is also nice. Let me go ahead and just kick it off with this because I don't want I want to draw land so I don't want to fetch yet <laughs> but we still got to hang out that weekend Gen Con was really fun right I wonder if we're supposed to play Abu Carol keep here and Hope to draw a third land or just like play Scalding Tarn. Yo, Hellforce, welcome to the stream. Thank you for playing the Fun Police. Somebody's gotta be the Fun Police. I think I'm just gonna jam the Abbot as much as I don't like it. Oh, let's do this. We're gonna, I hope it's not land. Okay, yeah, we can't play it. That was good, because we wanted a land that turn, so now we're not going to draw the Porcelain Legionnaire, and now maybe we can play... Oh, the Fiamancer is kind of annoying. We're going to have to two-for-one ourselves here. Yeah, we're going to have to burst lightning the Fiamancer. Lava Man the Snake. And then hit with this bad boy. Yeah, it's not really a two for one. It involves the lava man. That's a fair point. It does suck though, because it feels bad. Because that was all burned. That could have gone to their face. And instead, we like dealt four of them to their creatures. 
I really need a land next turn. I want to jam this Ferocid on. He's ready. He's put me in, coach. Put me in, coach. Okay, they cycled cast out. That's good for us. That was not bad. Nice. Okay, this is looking really nice now. I don't know what they have on. If we draw another land, we get to Heroic Reinforcement next turn. That's such big game. I love it. It's actually looking... Okay, Journey is fine. Okay, we didn't. But we still get to hit with both, and then we'll get to char them. Oh, yeah, that's right. We could have hit with Prowess. Uh, whoops. I guess we're going to Prowess a bunch next turn. Let's just char here. We can Magma Jet Lightning Bolt next turn to kill him. Though, if we draw a land, I think we're just going to Heroic Reinforcements. Well, yeah, let's just Heroic Reinforcements. Play perfect ish, get rewarded ish. <laughs> Am I really the hero? Oh, yeah. We are the unsung heroes of the. All right, sure. That does keep him alive for a little bit, but not too long. They are extremely dead. They, they would need to have something that gave them life right now because if they, even if they put Grizzlebrand in play, they just can't. Said. I did my math and thought it was dead. <laughs> Our opponent thought they were dead that turn. Not quite though. Get two of this. Reinforcements is really good. I I I even think I'm more I'm way more likely to play reinforcement than like ravages. The only way that the white splash is acceptable is if all your lands come into play on top. Like, even if they're painful. When you're playing top lands in a Boros deck, that's when you just, like... Okay, well... You did. Now I'm dead. <laughs> that's funny. Alright, round two. Oh, thank you, Dead Face Off. I appreciate that. Yes, reinforcement is smork. <laughs> Oh, interesting. I just got the I just got an invite to Artifact. Have you guys played Artifact? The new game by uh by who is it? I can't remember. Whose game is Valves? It's not out yet. Um I got a like Discord. Or sorry, I got a key to try it out. It is a new Richard Garfield game. Have you guys played it and is it sweet? Oh boy. I kind of want to keep this hand. We have one. Well, you might finish this draft. Yeah, I mean, that's part of the reason I wanted to draft Red Louise is because I wanted to actually finish. People said it's sweet. I've heard mixed things. All right, you guys, do we keep this hand or what? I need to go to bed in like a half hour. Do you think you can throw 3 by then? Uh, I don't know if in a half hour, but I think I can. we can do that in an hour probably. I'm going to keep it. going to risk it for the biscuit. I'm going to get a sacred foundry with this. Sounds good, DC. Enjoy F and M. So we're gonna go Jackal Pup into like Suspend Rift Bolt is the plan, I think. Just going for max pain. Ooh, okay, okay. I like them not doing literal land, land, land. Please, yes. I mean, like not the land that we wanted, but probably the land that we deserved. It does let us get closer to like... Maybe we should not be playing this uh, this land, but let's play it anyway. I'm gonna sus Yeah, I wanna suspend this. Okay. 
does get us closer to Hazzy, which is not the worst. Okay. Set them good. Target you. Oh, ho, ho, that works. That's really funny. That was a good draw. Go for the throat, my thing. Sure. I still get to get a land there. And then I'm probably just gonna lightning bolt their face. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, my beautiful little boom at baby. Or if they go some like vampire nighthawk here, I can just lightning bolt it. Oh, hold on. Let me make sure I have a stop on their main face. We have to kill this thing. Uh, I'll just burst you. Could stoke the flames here, but I think we're supposed to just attack with Boma and then bolt them. Yeah, we are kind of doing it. Mm. That's kind of annoying. I still think we need to play this Hazard, so I think we're just gonna lightning bolt face. Because I really want to hit land Hazzy. Swing. And we're not going to hit with Boma, but we can certainly hit with this. And then they just like get to buy it back, which kind of sucks. I guess we should send both, because if they block here to E, we just get in for five. Yeah, they're not going to block. Oh my god, they are going for that block? That's surprising. That's a really ambitious block. I'm really glad we attacked with both now. That was wild. I don't think you can ever make that block. Against a Hazard too? Maybe if they have Vraska's Contempt, they can see that block. If they have Vraska's Contempt me right now, that will make sense. No, just a Gumpty. Wait, we're playing standard? I know, this looks like standard. <laughs> oh, they're Grixis. Interesting. Wow, they... That's an aggressive attack. All right, so we're just gonna... I'm gonna keep Mountain to discard, I think. So I'm just gonna stoke their face. The one thing is, because they have to block here no matter what. So let's just go stoke face. You wanna discard? You wanna hold on to the... You wanna hold on to the stokes? Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. We just stoked the Gonti and that's lethal. What am I doing? Yeah, stoking Gonti is lethal. <laughs> God, the UI on City of Brass is pretty atrocious. I, why did they attack with their Phoenix? That was wild. They probably felt like they needed... Anger of the Gods ironically kills the Phoenix, but I don't think that's happening. I think they attack with Phoenix because otherwise they're super dead. Yeah, but the problem is I think if they're playing to draw maybe something like a Vraska's Contempt, that makes more sense, but that does leave them pretty dead. As opposed to they always have a blocker otherwise.
Perforos is good versus control? Um, yeah, I just don't think Perforos is very good at all. I think I'd rather- I like all the cards that we have instead. Yo, Stingray! Ray, thank you so much for the four months! I appreciate that! Welcome back! Bye! Which sets are in the queue? Basically like all the sets. As long as they're legacy legal. Uh, I think we're supposed to keep this hand, but man, it's like really not very good. Maybe we should just mull it. Because we're going to deal them two, then four, and then... Hello, everyone. Hope oh, thank you so much, Stingray. I am doing awesome. How are you doing today? Do you have any cool plans for the weekend? Yeah, maybe I'll just mulligan. I think we can do better. Uh, this is not much better, but I think we have to keep this one. That is a fine keep. Your insurance company said they didn't get payment and they're trying to cancel my policy to get to spend the next hour. Oh my gosh, there's. I had that happen recently. Ooh, dress is good against us. They're gonna take our bolt. Ooh, that sounds really good, Ray. I love it. Say hi to Emily for me. I think Luis is cooking dinner tonight. I'm excited for that. With 3 we get to eat some pork belly, and if not, we don't. Ooh. Grim Lava Mancer, huh? Yeah, I don't know if he's going to get pork belly, but I would love it if he did. Aw, oh, man. Peace out, Ferocidon. You're to hell Abbott until the Lava Man is dead. I wanted to just stagger shock to kill the lava man and then stagger shock their face. That's what I wanted to do next turn and attack with Abbott because I thought that if they played a card, like if they played something on this turn, they weren't going to have enough to uh, activate the lava man as well. So I actually think this is going to work out pretty nicely. We also get to prowess here, which is not nothing. They are so crazy for keeping uh, Raid the Bones in their deck. That's wild. <laughs> That's really aggressive against the Monored deck. I would never want to play Raid the Bones. And then next turn we get to trigger Prowess again off of the... Read the bones is set against essentially a burn deck seems bad. Yep, agreed, Jumbie. It is not great. Abaddon 2 is as good as it is as good as it gets in this hand. Yeah, there is a chance that we did want to just like sandbag the Abbot. It actually we would have drawn the Ferocid in the next turn, and that would have been a nice turn three play. Oh boy. Wait. Wait, why did they wait? Oh no. They goofed. They goofed very, very very badly, and now they're gonna pay. Yup. All right, Rabbles, you are dead. Um, I think we just play the courier and then tap the courier. Yeah, 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 and then we're gonna tap the courier to stoke with it, and then we'll attack with Abadakur, I'll keep, because it'll be... It'll be prowessed. All right. They also don't have this figure, they would've used it right there. Yeah, our deck actually totally got there. I'm pretty happy with how things turned out. This is a five, probably a Planeswalker is my guess. Maybe some Angrath action. Oh wow, they wield us? 
All right, I think I'm a... Uh... That was pretty unexpected. I guess I'll just play Mountain and attack with Bomad. I'm not gonna crack it yet. We would like a land so we can, like a white source so we can do this. Why'd they wheel? Oh, the plate did scream has he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess that that, that would make sense. Because we did go Bowmat. Like, it looks like we're just trying to get cards out of our hand. Oh, they, oh, that's true. They also knew that we had a Hazzy off dress. So yeah, I guess maybe they realized they could never beat Hazard in that spot. So they just like wheel it away. Oh, that's not bad. I'm going to do this now in case they, they are planning on killing this Bomat courier because I want to crack the Bomat and I want to have the Porcelain Legionnaire in play once I do. I'm not gonna crack it yet. I'm. If they're gonna keep letting me hit with it, I think we can hit next turn, crack the bow mat, and then maybe we could draw the last burn spell that way. Hey, Suaponte, thank you so much for the first time sub. Welcome on in. Uh, toxic deluge for one. Okay, now is the time to crack this. Well, that sucked. Good beats, good beats. I think I'd rather play this so we don't draw any more lands. All right, come on, something like a fireball. Our opponent could stabilize now. Okay, well, we're not doing anything that's good for us. I wanna crack this so we don't draw any more lands. Let's get the sacred foundry. Say no. Come on. So now I'm done playing cards, I think, because, or lands, because we don't have a hazard. It's the only reason for us to play it. Oh boy, that thing's gonna kill us fast. Okay, now we have a reason to play the lands again. Ooh, nice. Mountain, God, we drew them a mountain. Okay. All right, all right, any bird spell now off the top. Literally any bird spell. Come on. We've drawn a lot of lands, we can do this. This is five, six, seven, eight, nine. We've drawn more than half of our lands. We got this, we got this. Oh my gosh. <gasps> That's a problem. Okay, we have one turn. Thank gosh. Pew, 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 pew. Taste the Dokomoi. <laughs> Never didn't have it. <laughs> yeah. Don't 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 think I didn't see you. I know you're you're rooting against Monored, but the fun police is out there. Wee you, wee you. Lightning helix. <laughs> and you didn't even say char you. Charmander char. Alright. Can we get the trophy? We are 2-0. Yeah, 2040. Oh, oh. We got this. Wow, this hand's great. Where's Charmy? Oh, this is Charmy's deck. Hold on, let me get Charmy. All right, baby, this one's for you. This is a Red Rocks Me sort of hand. Uh, okay, so I think we're gonna kick it off and go Stromkirk Noble first, and then we'll go Falconoth Gorger Goblin Guide. Let me see what this say. Oh, hi. Oh, hi there. Thanks, less than three. Good luck, have fun. Let's do this, Noble. Are you a fan now, B. Morrissey? Bum police! Pew, 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 pew! Oh, 
Okay, so spending a cloud skate is kind of exactly what I want them to do. Alright. Teferi Mage of Zalfir, okay. Oh my. I promised fun to my opponent, but I lied. All right, they have a Jace Vrinch Prodigy on top of their deck. What is my favorite in all of Magic? Blue. All right, grow, my little noble. Grow. Um, all right, so we're going to Magma Jet Lightning Bolt them next turn, I guess, and then hope to put a land, put a land on top for Hazi is the plan. Yeah. Ooh, I like that they couldn't do anything with a miscalc. Jace can't block, no, we'll taste it. All right, how many counters does that Riftwing have? One more. Okay. Miss the draft, how motivated, what motivated us to fun police? Basically, I have to get going here in a second. I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to finish this draft, so I was like, if we draft fun police, I can definitely finish the draft. Uh, Master of Babes, huh? That is pretty annoying. All right. Let's let Master do its thing. Yeah, I'll probably jet the token. I'll jet the token and lightning bolt their face. Uh, bottom, and I do want one of these for Hazi. Top, and then lightning bolt face. Alright, they do have the Rift Wing next turn, but this is gonna be so much damage this turn. Yeah, we did it! <sighs> Alright, we're playing against like Mono Blue deck, I think. I think it's just like straight up Mono Blue. Like, I think it's gonna have the Djinn of Wishes or whatever he's called. <laughs> Cash Cannon! Yeah, it has, also has ability next turn. Yeah, we, we, we had that covered. We had it covered. The Master Waves is annoying. Tempest Jin, that's what it's called. It's not the Jin of Wishes. I'm just making names now. All right, I don't think we should be playing the Plains, by the way. I think the Plains was pretty bad. So I think we just play a Mountain. Can almost, yes. I can almost taste the pork belly. It's almost in my stomach. Oh God, I'm so excited. I wonder what he is gonna make. I don't know what he's making. Metamorph? I don't love Metamorph. Metamorph is a creature that could attack into uh, Master Ways, which is interesting. Jinnah Wishes is a card. But I was thinking a Ring of Three Wishes, so I'm just clearly just saying random things. Yeah, I played that Jinn of Wishes a bunch of times. That card was not too shabby. Play Iron Cut Ravages. Or a counterpoint bluff. I play Ravages and don't play Irish Shaman. Gotta be saying random things. Must be an A that ends in Y, yes. Couldn't you fire the Master and kill a token in the same turn because Master gives plus one plus one to tokens? Well, Master Waves also has other text, Aussie, which says pro red. So uh, if I had a black way to kill the Master, that play would work out great. Thanks, Digital. Yeah, Master Waves, technology. Okay, we have the mulligan in this hand. Not even close to being a keep. All right, we can keep this one and... Bomey, huh? I think we have to just try to get a land here. Yeah, I don't think we can keep this. I'm sorry, Bomey. Nice. Time to investigate the local brewery. That sounds pretty fun, Penguin. Enjoy. Enjoy. 
Okay, I like our hand. I hope we draw a Goblin Guide next turn. That would be really sweet. And then we can go Goblin Guide Firebolt Face. Yo, Therion, how are you? Welcome. Oh, we can deal with that, no problem. Firebolt that. And then we'll Lightning Bolt Face is my guess. And attack with Jackalpup. Hmm. Oh, their mana's screwed. Maybe? So, if I deal this three, will they actually take three? They don't, right? I think it dies before they take three. So I think sadly I still just have to burst lightning this thing. Although I guess I the problem is I don't have another creature because otherwise I could just attack with a jackal pup, but then I don't have no no pup. So I think I have to burst lightning that. Yeah, that sucks. I wish I would have taken damage. Oh well. This is I think I just three them with that. Yo, Kawaii Senpai, how are you? I could just wait and uh, just lightning bolt their face, and then the following turn we like collect the defiance or something, or like kill one of their creatures. Yeah, I think I, I don't really need to use this right now. All right, the hit land. Okay, that's annoying, but not a big problem. We're definitely going to go Lightning Bolt Face, because if we draw Hazzy at any point here, we're going to want to play her. This costs how much to flashback? Five. So let's hit with Jackal Pup again. Yeah, we could uh, Escalate now and wield the Heroic Reinforcements. Because then that also gets stuff in the yard for our lava men if we ever... Yeah, all right, so let's deal three damage to... We want to escalate with two modes. We want three to them, and target player draws that many cards. I'm not wheeling them, I'm wheeling us. Because we have an uncastable card in our hand right now. Uh, so I'm going to cast... Choose target player. Target player discards all cards in their hand and draws that many cards, so that's us. Three damage to them, pay four. All right, cool, we, we wield into a magma jet, which is nice. It's a sorcery, I don't know why we would wait. We need some, we need a little bit of action here. Yeah, we could, I'm gonna uh, set an upkeep stop because we might wanna upkeep that. Yeah, I, I, I think we want to use our mana there, too. Jerdy to know or our pup. Yeah, all right. Given that, I think I'm going to just upkeep Jet. Do I play Commander? No, almost never. <laughs> bottom, bottom. Goblin guy. Goblin guy. Goblin guy. Come on. Give me something good. Oh, frick. I'm gonna play it though, because now we can cast a firebolt from the yard. Yeah, char, 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 char. We have a lot of life draws. They actually have to do something meaningful to gain life here. What is this? Two mana? Is this a JVP? Oh, Riftwing Cloudskate. That doesn't do anything. Come on, Revelation. Come on, Sponzy. Why? Well, that's just rude. All right. We Firebolt Face and then just hope to get there. All 
All right, cool. So any spell now will be pretty good, but now we're we're it's up to the it's up to the draft gods to decide. Oh, jeez! God damn it! Well, that's a good draw. Because I still get to get him back down, and then I can start pitching to Hazard. So, that was a really good draw. I know, we had it one turn earlier. Because they're going to go back up. Are we holding this mountain? I think we are. Because I want to discard it. I want, yeah, I think I just want to hold it for like discard fodder. Because if I draw like, if I draw like a burn spell and I can discard the mountain, I might be able to kill them. God, this celestial colony can start like blocking as well. Yeah, hold the baby. Where's... Where are we hold hold the baby? Hold. This looks like animating colonnade. Oh my gosh, no. All right. I believe that is us losing the game. Hey, Yuka, how are you? Welcome. Well, we could still trophy, even though we're not going to 306 0. Damn, the Loxed and Warhammer is working us. Well, as long as we can't do anything about that. I guess we can just stop them from gaining life again with a rift wing. They brought in all the hate. They really did. Kira is very good against us. I don't believe we can draw anything here. Sure. She still can't attack. All right, I don't think we could fe bring Field of Ruin to kill um, Colonnade, but I feel like if that's the angle in which we're fighting, like that's not really where we want to be at. We do want Torch Fiend because we need to get rid of um... Wait, no, this destroys target artifact. This doesn't destroy treachery. But they have Loxed and Warhammer, so we need to kill that. I don't know how much we want the heroic reinforcements. I do think we keep the ravages. Though they're both quite good. Yeah, other random swords maybe if they have any. That's fair. So we need to make one more cut. Yeah, I don't think we're beating an active colonnade, so we shouldn't worry about it. I need to cut one more thing. Cut a mountain. We're gonna be on the play, 15 lands. Yeah, I can see cutting a mountain. The problem is we're on the play. It's a little, it's a little aggro. I think I'm not gonna live on the edge. Maybe I just cut um, Collective Defiance. Collective Defiance is like just okay. Nah, I think I wanna keep the Ravages. It's pretty good if we ever like get there with the Ravages. This is intense, it is. Cool. All right. Can I get a good hand? 
It's not the best, but it is, I think, serviceable. We want to crack Scalding Tarn immediately, I think. Although we could just do it on two because it's not like we... It does stop us from drawing another land potentially, but I think we just go Mountain, Lava Mancer, and then on turn two we'll probably play Fetch and then Firebolt their face attack with Lava Mancer. <laughs> Raise your hand if Mighty's in your name. Yeah, Caroline has Mighty in her name. It's sweet. Ooh, hello. Now I'm just gonna do it on three. Yo, Jamie fans, thanks for continuing the gifted sub. Let me Firebolt face and then play Goblin Guide like this. And I'll just do it on, th maybe I'll just do it next turn. Baral, huh? <laughs> we drew the Sacred Foundry punished. Yeah, 1-3. That is rude, isn't it? All right, so now we can just Scalding Tarn. We could attack, because if we attack and they block with Baral, then we play Scalding Tarn, fetch. Oh, but then we have to fetch away the Firebolt. So no, attacking into this Baral is actually not looking very good. Attack with everything except Lava Mancer. So you mean Goblin Guide Digital, because we... <laughs> yeah, I think we're just going to Ferocidon. They don't even need to know. Yeah, all right. I, I am going to crack this, I think. Okay. I want to stop drawing lands. If we draw Hazzy next turn, we can attack and uh, play an attack. It's pretty nice. The next turn, we can attack with everyone. Ooh, Old Man of the Sea is kind of annoying. Yeah, it is. I think we just attack with both. And if they block with Goblin Guide to the Old Man of the Sea, then I can just exile uh, Goblin Guide and Tarn, kill the Old Man. Yeah, this sucks, but we have to attack with both Goblin Guide and Ferocidon. All right, hopefully we don't draw them a land. Impulse. Yeah. Interesting. They're going for the double block on the Ferocidon. So we can actually take that old man of the sea down. Boral gets to live, and then eventually we'll just get to level man something. So let's let that happen. Uh, and combat. So let's go ahead and play Sacred Foundry, not pay for it. Yeah, that, that trade was fine. And then we'll be able to use a Lava Man to dome them in a second. We could also also save it. Um, and then if attack with Goblin Guide and they block, and then we can just Lava Mancer to finish it off. We do need to draw some action, though. Coalition Relic. All right. Clan old man, you monster. <laughs> this is better than Master Waves. We couldn't have beaten that if they played it. I think we actually just Rift Bolt the Baral and attack, start attacking with both. We actually probably don't attack with a Lava Mancer. I think we just actually attack with a Goblin Guide. 
Do you think we attack with a Lava Mancer? I kind of want to leave the ability to activate it. It is one free damage because it's not damage that we're using off of here. Because we're going to Firebolt next turn. Yeah, alright. Good plan. Let's see what they hit. Treachery. Ugh. Gross. That is... that sucks. Also, they have a Coalition Relic so they can steal our Grim Lava Mancer and start using it. Oh my gosh. That sucks for us. All right, we need a Hazzy now. Hazzy, please. That's not terrible. Yeah, this is this is really tough. <laughs> Cause we could try to burst lightning the the Ojutai as it attacks us too. Cause we could go. What other burn is in the deck? We have a lot. So burst lightning hits for four, and this is five six, and then any three gets us there. Yeah, I think we have to go phase. So, oh, we can't just kill this. We can't attack with Goblin Guide. It's like not a, not an actual play that we can make. And Lava Mancer is going to take down our Goblin Guide no matter what. So I think we just have to get lucky. If that's true, I think we go Mountain, Flashback, Firebolt, go phase, and put him down to seven. And then the next turn we're going to have to Burst Lightning... Kill Mancer, then take two, then burn next. Nah, I don't like that play at all, Redstone. Because we can't... Yeah, yeah, that is not that is not a fight I am going to fight. So I think we do just play Mountain. Firebolt their face. Can't attack. Bluff path. God, no Warhammer, please. That would be so bad. But I do think we're supposed to use the sorcery spell. Because they're, they're always going to play around that one. I kind of don't want them to know what else is going on in my hand. I assume this is just going to be our goblin guide's going to be dead. Yep. Feels bad. Yeah. Now, this this is an out to like draw Rift Bolt or Bolt. We, we have a lot of things that we can draw. Yeah, drawing Bolt would be smart. Agreed. Okay, well, we're not getting through with creatures anymore. We know that. Sure. All right. Bolt, 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 or Rift Bolt. Bolt, or Rift Bolt. Please! <laughs> Caroline, why? <laughs> What if we did just draw a number cool? That would be kind of sweet. Okay. We can work with that. We can work with that for sure. So, I think we just pass. Yeah. And then we're going to try to burst lightning them at the end of the turn. Oh boy, what is this? That's fine. <sighs> I'm nervous. 
All right. Okay, that's great. Now they need something like Pact of Negation. Yes! God, we got there! Ah, oh, feels good, man. Where is it? Hold on. If you like this video, you can subscribe for more. And if you want to come say hi to us on the live stream, that's on twitch.tv slash I stream every weekday in the afternoons, mountain times. See you later.